So you decided to come then? Yeah, I was just getting them in. Oh, I'll have a pint then. Cheers. There you go. So. This don't feel right. I should go. Oh, please, just, just stay for one at least. But Jerry. I'm sorry. This is a bad idea. Look, I don't want any trouble. Just let me pass, please. Oh, sorry, mate. No problem. Doug, hang on. Look, I heard what happened earlier. The police charging you. Right. And you should know that whatever punishment comes my way, it won't be enough. Well, I believe you. And the truth is, if Jerry was still here, he'd be the first one time to cut you some slack. I'm not asking for anyone's forgiveness, Aaron. I know you know. Doug? Douglas Potts? I'm sorry. Whoa. Murderer! You deserve that after what he's done. Right, you better get out before I throw you out. I'm not leaving. That bloke killed my nephew. What? You're Jerry's Uncle Terry? You should be in prison right now. Don't you even care what you've done? Oh, more than you know. Have I missed something? Yeah, don't worry, Pollard. I don't think it's over yet. Chaz, can we go through the back? Get him properly dried off. Yeah, you don't have to ask. And you're right. I deserve a lot worse. Come on, Doug. Look, I'm sorry. When you didn't reply to my text, I just thought you weren't interested. Well, I'm here, aren't I? Yeah, I didn't mean anything. <sighs> Look, it hadn't sunk in. But it's our Jerry. I, I had to come. Yeah, well, there's easier ways of announcing yourself. I just heard his name and... I still can't believe it. On the house. Try not to tour this one over anyone, though, please. Sorry, I just... I didn't mean to lose it like that. Jerry, um... He used to stay with me and Robert. He'll, uh... He'll be missed. He already is. Yeah, he had a lot of mates around here. We were all here to talk about the funeral. That's his best mate over there, Lachlan. I know about you. He spoke about you all the time. Yeah? When did you last see him? Uh, recently, I, uh... <sighs> you never realise when it's going to be the last time you see someone, do you? You probably don't want to hear this. But I need you to know how sorry I am. And I will face up to whatever comes my way. Jerry was my friend. And you should know that not one hour passes where I don't think about that lad. Doug's a good bloke. He was like a great granddad to Jerry. Times like this, it's easy to feel guilty about what we might have done differently. I mean, guilt I felt when my Steve went and got hit by that electricity pylon. Steve? He was your husband? Cockatoo. Cockatoo? I accidentally killed one of our pigs once. I couldn't sleep for weeks. Well, now you know why Jerry loved it here. 